It is right that we should stand by and act on our principles, but not right to hold them in obstinate blindness, or retain them when proved to be erroneous. The important thing is to know how to take all things quietly. All are sure in their days except the most wise. He is the wisest philosopher who holds his theory with some doubt. I happen to have discovered a direct relation between magnetism and light, also electricity and light, and the field it opens is so large and I think rich. A man who is certain he is right is almost sure to be wrong. I can at any moment convert my time into money, but I do not require more of the latter than is sufficient for necessary purposes. The book of nature which we have to read is written by the finger of God. Speculations? I have none. I am resting on certainties. Water is to me, I confess, a phenomenon which continually awakens new feelings of wonder as often as I view it. Why will people go astray when they have this blessed book to guide them? Nothing is too wonderful to be true, if it be consistent with the laws of nature. But still try, for who knows what is possible. Lectures which really teach will never be popular. Lectures which are popular will never really teach. There's nothing quite as frightening as someone who knows they are right. I am no poet, but if you think for yourselves, as I proceed, the facts will form a poem in your minds. I have far more confidence in the one man who works mentally and bodily at a matter than in the six who merely talk about it. Nature is our kindest friend and best critic in experimental science if we only allow her intimations to fall unbiased on our minds. Since peace is alone the gift of God, and as it is he who gives it, why should we be afraid? His unspeakable gift in his beloved Son is the ground of no doubtful hope. 